Welcome to Jared's Bike Checks. We're getting up with the sun is a way of life. Let's get to it. All right, guys. Well, we got the old hammock up in storm mode again. It was supposed to rain again last night, but luckily nothing happened. Boy, I've been really skimming by with that. Sun's on its way up. Beaver was down in the water. Thanks for watching and stay tuned. Welcome to Jared's Bike Checks, where motorized bikes are a way of life. Let's get to it. Alright guys, we're up at 7.30 in the morning. We're climbing this little mountain in, uh, in a little bit slow gear here. Probably going 10 miles an hour. Sorry about that. We stayed down at the Santa Clara Creek last night and we've gotten up with the sun this morning and we're heading out and feeling good. It's nice and warm this morning, probably near 70 degrees. Maybe 68 at least. I know I know if I come to a stop and move around a little bit, I start getting hot and sweaty, so I got myself moving. Alright guys, stick around, more to come. Welcome to Jerry's Bike Checks. The motorized bikes are a way of life. Let's get to it. All right, guys. Well, we're inside San Antonio now. As y'all can see, the big city is just in front of me. We're creeping through this these streets right now with the camera out. I'm in uh, stealth mode. It also keeps me from running down this hill at fucking 50 miles an hour. Hey, babies. Good looking dogs right there. All right, well, I'm gonna put y'all down for this stop sign right here. Hackenberry. Hackberry, not hacking, Hackberry. It's a Sunday, so it's not too busy. Everybody should be going to church here any minute. So, to keep the roads clear for another two hours. Or clear it. As clear as you can get for a big city. Alright, no stop time. One second. Alright, well, we're back. A little time in the back. It never hurt nobody. Alright, I'll pull it back out when we get to the fucking big city building. Boy, they are everywhere. Welcome to Jared's Bike Check, where motorized bikes are a way of life. Let's get to it! Alright guys, well we made it out of San Antonio at around 11 a.m. We're hauling ass towards Brackettville, about 118 miles away. So, I don't know if we'll make it that far or not, but that's where we're heading towards. We're on the full-blown Highway 90 West right now. Oh, we made it through that fucking San Antonio. There was a lot of fucking homeless and fucking weirdos lingering around. 
I got the fuck out of there as fast as possible. They were shooting heroin right down the goddamn street corners. Hi guys, so we're going through Castroville in Texas. Uh, next town outside of San Antonio. I camped right there on this river right here. Let me turn this camera around. Welcome to Jared's Bike Checks, where motorized bikes are a way of life. Let's get to it. So we passed up my other campsite, we're just going to keep on rolling through. We do have a mission today to try to find cigarette tubes, but I bought an extra pack of cigarettes. First pack, pack of cigarettes I bought since uh, four years ago on same trip. But, you know, I ain't opened them yet, so hopefully I ain't got to open them until I get really desperate. brought tobacco, but I did not bring any extra tubes. Picnic area, one mile. I remember it. They just got through passing me just a few minutes ago. Heading into the meat market. Tell me if you guys see a tobacco store. <laughs> I stopped at that McDonald's, stood out there in charge last time I was here. Can you even walk inside? Ah, uh, no, you still can't walk inside these fucking places. Goddamn fucking let's go, Brandon. Welcome to Jerry's Bike Check. Motorized bikes are way of life. All right, guys, well, we just made it through little Frio, Texas, and we're headed for Brackettville. I'm not sure how far away I am yet, but I'm uh, probably about 50 miles, I bet, or more. Maybe more than that. So let's just keep this show going. I'll let y'all ride with me for a few. Dry Frio River. All these things keep saying river and creek, and I ain't seen nair fucking drop of fucking water yet. Holy shit, they're all dry. I do know the one I'm headed to in Brackettville's got water in it. Or at least it has the past four years that I went there. 500 miles! Woo! 500 miles left of Highway 90. I think it's 1,300 miles or some shit or another. I told myself I was gonna stop at that sign. I had no idea it was gonna be on a fucking bridge just then. Ah, uh, they're getting to, getting to be some fucking hills now. Look at that goddamn helicopter on a truck fucking trailer. That was pretty fucking cool. I've been chasing these clouds for three days now and 
it looks like they're starting to break free and I might be in the sunshine here soon. I've already got a little bit of burn on my hands, my nose. But, you know, you got to get it tanned somehow. Big ass cotton farms. All kind of cotton on the road. Certainly stuff a pillow or two with it. Mesquite trees. We in mesquite country now. Running low on green leaves and more on these little tiny ass brown looking fucking mesquite leaves. And yucca, big giant yuccas. I had a couple of border patrols give me the old big hands up just a minute ago when I went by them. I bet I blew their socks off. Welcome to Jared's Bike Checks, where motorized bikes are a way of life. Let's get to it. All right, guys. Well, we're here for sunset in Brackettville at the old Dollar General. <laughs> we'll put the charge on the on the big bore. We're going to be staying down by the Pinto River, Pinto Creek, one of the two. And uh, might even take tomorrow off sitting down there at the pavilions uh, next to the creek. Maybe get a little fishing in, eat some hot dogs, you know, regular old stuff. I think I got over a thousand miles today. All right, guys. Welcome to Jared's Bike Checks, where motorized bikes are way of life. Let's get to it. All right, guys, we're down at a picnic area down by the Pedro River, uh, Pedro Creek. Uh, this is just outside of Brackettville, Texas. We're about a thousand miles in right now. Didn't get here until about 8:30 this evening. Covered about 170 miles today. It's my biggest day yet. Uh, we got Highway 90 right there. We got the river down that way. Probably about two, three hundred feet. Got my stuff laid out so I can have me a little late dinner. And and there's the bike. Thanks a lot, guys. Keep on watching. <laughs> 